Good morning. It's time for us to talk about the new way that we are putting up your um, math assignments um, and the videos that we're going to be um, that you're going to be able to view to complete your math assignment. Um, we decided to begin creating assignments for your math assignments in Schoology because um, many of you were not watching the actual math videos and so we're hoping that this will help you to see them and submit your assignment uh, to us. So you are going to start by just like every day you need to log into Schoology. You log into Schoology through the website lms.lausd dot net. You need to put in your LAUSD email and your password. If you don't know your LAUSD email or password, please contact your teacher through Class Dojo and they will get it for you. Um, so when you log into Schoology, the first thing that you want to do is you want to come up here to courses and you are going to pick your course. Okay, so my course has a picture like this. Miss Montano's course has a picture, uh, a bitmoji of her, and Mr. Powell's is like a little yellow picture. But whatever course you're in, you only have one to choose from. Simply choose that course. And once you choose that course, you're going to see all of your apps to the left. You're going to see all of the folders that contain your assignments in the middle. And over here on the right, you're gonna see any upcoming assignments that you were assigned for the week, okay? So we're going to begin talking here Monday, May 11th. So far, there are two assignments here posted. Um, there is a new ZLA assignment that you're going to need to go in watch Mr. Powell's video and he will teach you how to do that. That video is in this assignment. So you'll click it and you'll watch the video. It'll tell you what to do. So for math, you are going to click on the math assignment for today, May 11th. When you click on it, it will take you to the assignment and you see the directions right here that you need to do. You should do these directions in order. Okay, <coughs> excuse me. So first you're gonna watch the video. Down here is the video. So step one, you're going to click on the video and you're gonna watch it. Step two, you're gonna complete your math book pages 743 to 746 in your math book. Once you complete it, you're going to submit a picture to your teacher. You can either submit the assignment or you can either submit the picture here in the assignment, which I'm going to show you in a minute. You can send them a picture through Class Dojo or you can send your teacher an email. To submit the, the picture here in the assignment, you click Submit Assignment and then it gives you some options. If you want to um, if you want to submit the picture here, you simply put file and then you upload the picture that you've saved on your device. So you should have the picture on your device and you'll be able to upload it here if you push file. Um, once you have submitted the picture to the teacher, you can go ahead and type done, have your file and submit. Boys and girls, do not click submit if you have not sent your teacher a picture. If you've not sent, if you have not sent your teacher a picture, you will not get a grade on the assignment. So please, in the box, you type in where you sent the picture. So obviously, if you sent the picture here, then you're going to put the picture. Then you are going to type done and you're gonna click submit. If you sent it to Class Dojo, put sent pick in Class Dojo. 
if you sent a picture an email, put sent pic in email. And go ahead and send that and submit that so that your teacher knows that you sent the picture, they can look for it, and then they can give you your grade on your assignment. Okay, boys and girls, so make sure when you go to um, Schoology at lms.leusd.net, you click on courses, and then you click on the assignment that you need to work on over here on the right. If there are assignments that were already due and you need to go back and complete them, you can click on this little calendar and it will show you assignments that were previously done. You can click those and you can do assignments that you missed from before. Okay, all right, boys and girls, um, make sure you do all your work so that you can get all the learning that you need to do so that you can be ready for fifth grade. Okay, 